The no command error is one of the most common issues MetaQuest users encounter. Understanding what this error means and how to address it can save you time and frustration. The no command error appears as this distinctive screen with an Android robot and exclamation mark. This error indicates a problem during the boot process of your MetaQuest headset. This error typically occurs in three main situations. When initiating recovery mode, after a failed software update, or during general system boot issues. Each scenario requires a slightly different approach to resolve. The no command error can be caused by software glitches, incomplete updates, or potential hardware malfunctions. Understanding the root cause helps determine the best troubleshooting approach. Before attempting any advanced fixes, perform these essential preliminary checks. Ensure your headset is fully charged, inspect it for any visible damage, and verify all cable connections are secure. Start with basic troubleshooting steps. First, try a simple restart by holding the power button and selecting power off from the menu. This can resolve minor software glitches. If a simple restart doesn't work, try a force shutdown by holding the power button for 10 to 15 seconds. This forces the headset to completely shut down and can resolve more stubborn software issues. These initial troubleshooting steps resolve many no command errors and prepare your headset for more advanced solutions if needed. Always start with these simple fixes before moving to more complex procedures. When basic troubleshooting fails to resolve the no command error, a factory reset becomes necessary. This process restores your MetaQuest device to its original state, but it will delete all your data and settings. The first method uses your headset's boot menu. Start by powering off your MetaQuest device completely. Then hold both the power button and the volume down button simultaneously until you see the boot screen appear. You'll see a screen like this USB update mode interface. Use the volume buttons to navigate through the menu options and use the power button to make your selection. Navigate to Factory Reset and select it. The second method uses the MetaQuest mobile app. Open the app, tap on Devices, select your connected headset, then navigate to Advanced Settings where you'll find the Factory Reset option. If your device is stuck in a boot loop or during an update, Meta has introduced a specialized software update tool. This tool can help recover devices that are unresponsive to normal troubleshooting methods. If all troubleshooting methods fail to resolve the no command error, your final option is to contact Meta Support directly. They can provide additional assistance or arrange a replacement if your device is still under warranty.